Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is another in my series of how I edit my videos in Windows Movie Maker. This one is how you add a title screen in your video. Now, the only time I add this screen is when I'm usually doing a tutorial and I have to put like an ingredient list or a list of steps. And this one is just that too. This is a mug cake video that I did. I filmed this a while ago and I still have to put it up on my channel, but I've gotten to the point where I have to put the ingredient list. So I thought I would show you guys how to go about doing that. So go ahead and listen. Cause it's going to say something like here are the list of ingredients you need need to make this cake. Okay. Now when I film a video, I know, I knew that I was going to put the ingredient list up there. So when I do that, when I said, here are the list of ingredients that you need to make this cake, I will pause for three or four seconds. So I know I have time to split the video without interrupting the rest of the video. So right where my cursor is, let me enlarge this a little bit. Do you see where that black line is? And I have my cursor there. If you right click and split it, that's what you need to do. Then what you need to do, let's go over here to where it says title, click on that and see where it put right where you split it. It put a title screen. Now you can change the color of the screen and the color of your text. I always change the color of the screen. You know me, I like bright colors. So to change the color of the screen, you need to go up here to background color. I'm going to put this bright blue. Now the text duration, the default is seven seconds because this is an ingredient list. I am actually going to make it 12 and a half seconds and you can change that. You just saw where I clicked that. You can also see these little things. This is also the way the text comes in and goes out. You can just have it appear. You can have it do. I like that bouncing or that way. I mean, they give you a couple different options. So the default is where it, it moves like that. I'm actually going to have it. I think, Hmm. I'm just going to click this and just have it on the screen where it doesn't move or anything. Okay. Now I need to type. Well, first off, you can make the text centered left justification or right justification. I'm actually going to click on the left just because I know I'm going to have a wider sentence where it wouldn't fit if it was centered. Plus I like to have an ingredient list, you know, all on the left side. So you just do that and you start typing. I'm going to put ingredients you will need. Now I'm going to edit that, meaning I'm going to stretch it. So it fits all on one line and I'm going to move this up. Actually, I'm just going to type it like this one egg, one tablespoon vegetable oil. I'm going to have to make the text a little bit smaller. Yeah, stupid frosting. No frosting in the kit. Okay. I am going to select all of the text and you can go up here. See where it says font size. I'm going to move it to 36 since there you go. That does it. And actually I'm going to put that Hmm. Wait a minute. Okay. 
I'm going to delete this one. Okay, that looks pretty good. And I'm also going to add music to this. So remember, your text is 12 and a half. You also need to make sure you edit the video. The vi the See where you click on the video tools? The duration has to match the duration of the text. Otherwise, the text will be on the screen that you don't want. So now those both are matched up. I'm going to add music to just this section. I'm going to add my outtakes music. You also have to edit your music. <clears throat> See how it's like stretched all the way because the music is longer than 12 and a half seconds. You just click on here and that was in a separate video. I told you how to do the music. I'm not going to have it fade in, but I am going to have it fade out and I'm going to decrease the volume of the music. So let's go ahead and play that and see what it looks like. Need to make this cake. You know what? I'm going to edit I'm going to edit that again of how it appears. I don't like how that just No. Ooh, I like that one. I like that one. Okay, that's the default, that one. All right, let's play that again. Need to make this cake. Now you see how it takes so long to edit a video, and this is just one piece of it. And I can even shave off that little bit right there because I had paused. Yeah, let me split that, remove it. Trust me, as you go along and you start editing your videos, you will get faster. Okay, there is a two other parts where I can add the text, the title screen for the ingredients. I'm going to pause the video till I find that spot and I'll be right back. Okay, I am to the part where it says, here is step one. Step one. And again, I paused for, I'm gonna move it over so you can see. I paused for good four or five seconds in there. You split it, right click and split, and then go back over here to where it says title. Click on the title. Remember the default is black. I'm going to change the background color to that beautiful blue. It reminds me of DMC 996. I'm going to change the text duration to 12 and a half seconds again, which means I also have to change the video duration to 12 and a half seconds. Whoops, I changed it to 15. That I didn't mean to click that. Okay, now you can add your text. So I just need to put, and I'm going to leave it white, but I'm also going to do it, I'm going to do it in the center. No, I'm not. I'm going to do it left justification. Okay. And you just type whatever you need to type. Okay. And I'm actually, let me try to see what it looks like if I try to put it all on. Okay, that looks good. I like that. Yeah, you just have to fool with it until you get it to how you want it. Okay, I'm once again, I'm going to add music to it because that's just how I roll. I like to add music to the little screens. The outtakes music again. Remember, you have to go in and edit your music. You know it's 12 and a half seconds. I'm going to have it fade out, and I'm going to decrease the volume of the music. All right, so let's watch that and see how that did. This is step one. Oh, it looks so good. And 
I paused, like I said, I can cut this little tiny bit here because I paused a good four or five seconds. I would rather pause too much than not enough and then you're cutting into the rest of your video. Okay, there is one more spot where I need to put step two. So I'm gonna pause the video until I find that and I'll be right back. Okay, yeah, I had made a mistake when, and I didn't say here is step two, but we're gonna put step two right here where I paused it. So once again, you do the right click and you split it. And then you come over to title. Remember, I chose the background color as the blue. I'm gonna do the text duration as 12 and a half seconds. I'm gonna do it left. Justification. And then just start typing. And I'm gonna make it so it's, there we go. Let me move that up a little bit. I'm supposed to let it rest for one minute before serving. Remember, you have to edit the video text to be 12 and a half seconds to match your text. And I'm also going to add music to it. Okay, let's play it to see if it looks okay. I'm going to back it up even more. Yeah, that's pretty easy, folks. You turn the microwave for two minutes. Okay, that worked. Okay, guys, that's it for today's video. As always, if you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section below, and I will answer them to the best of my ability. Thank you for watching and subscribing, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.